G'day YouTubers, uh, Dano from Down Under here mate, something a bit different from the uh, flight simulation videos but um, I'm wiring up a uh, Yamaha um, Apple motor uh, electrical system for a friend of mine and just want to go through the Namir 2000 interface system that you need for a 2014 225 250 or 300 hour board. Um, you will need obviously um, I'll show you the basic stuff. Obviously, we've got some gauges up there which are plugged in, and uh, they're the, uh, the 6Y8s, uh, which display basically the same information as the Mir 2000 system does. Um, main harness coming from the back of the boat through the front here, all through here, into the front ECU, which is here. And then from there, we have our Yamaha bus systems. I've just put this one in. Um, with our one, two, three device ports. This port here is uh, to link your bus systems together via a cable. That's your power source for the bus system. And then I've got another link cable down here, one there and one to there. And then I've got a cable from here going to the Namir 2000 interface kit, which has the Namir cable connection just there, which is basically one of those. And that will go straight into your backbone, and then you'll be able to display all your information as well as engine alarms, etc., on your Lowrance or Simrad um, head units, which is all good and fun to have. So that's the basic configuration, guys. Um, you do need that module there, that cable, and then you need a jumper cable to your original bus box here and obviously if you need to expand your ports they've got two spare ports there device ports now for extra gauges etc if i need to um, and that's basically how the system works so you've got um, gauge one gauge two that goes off to somewhere down the end back of the motor i don't know where that's my namir uh, hook up to here and then your cable going out to the backbone a quick video not very much not much information on um on the um websites and stuff on how to do this so i thought i'd just do a quick easy video so people know exactly what interface system to get being this one and uh genuine yamaha parts uh, there is a single cable you can buy that apparently doesn't display engine alarms etc it's a little bit cheaper and again that can be plugged into the device ports on your bus system or if you've got the older motors at the back of the motor behind the cowling underneath the cowling at the back of the motor same four pin plug but it's just at the back of the motor rather than coming up to the front helm area and using one of these device ports on your bus system so i thought i'll uh thanks youtubers and uh have a great afternoon i'll continue on